I only used Wild Bolt for 30 matches in Wizard 101 PvP, and you guys won't believe what happened. I'm so cooked, bro. I just and this this needs to hit like max. It did! Oh my god! The the luck's been good, man. Oh my god! No, there's I'm done. I'll see you guys. I know, I know, Ben. <gasps> oh my god! I hit Max! <laughs> Give me the one shot. We got the one shot! Let's go! Yes! Oh my god, let's go! Oh, wait, right? Dude, there is literally. Oh my god! Guys! No way! There's no way! I just got reported! I just got reported! Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome into the video today. A little bit of a different video than I usually do here on the channel. I thought this would be pretty fun, pretty entertaining. I hope you guys feel the same. But, as you can see by the title of the video, I'm going to be doing 30 matches of Grandmaster Storm PvP. And that is the level 50 version of PvP. Only using the spell Wild Bolt. This spell is absolutely ridiculous. The fact that it's two pips and in the game still and it can do up to a yeah, thousand damage at the base is just completely beyond me. Apparently, I was the only one that thought that each of the 10, 100, and 1000 was a 33% chance to hit. But when I took the stats and I kept note of like all the stats and all the different bolts that I hit, it's more like a normal distribution where the middle, the 100, is like 50% of the time it's that. I also want to go over the stats. So I'm scaling down as an exalted storm wizard. So my stats get scaled down to what they would be if I was around level 50. So I'm about at 2,261 health. We have 98 damage, about 30 resist, 37 accuracy. So I won't fizzle anything. Um, we have crit doesn't matter. I have 17 pierce. I pierce through a good bit, you know, um, and then 95% power pip. That's probably going to come into play a little bit. I think I pip failed some of my matches, so I couldn't use a um, a bolt on certain turns and that is why in the deck I have some utility I have some shields I have a couple shields here reshuffle in case I need to uh, you know if it's a, like a life jading or something and just a couple of blades if I want to do that on my off turn I know this is a bolt only challenge and again I'm only gonna be hitting with wild bolt as the only damage that I'll be doing throughout this entire 30 matches however sometimes when I get first turn I really like to put a little bit of additional pressure by putting a blade on first and then bolting the next turn to maybe see if I can get a little bit of extra damage on if I do get lucky and hit a max bolt. You guys can say what you want, but that, that is that is what I do. And again, I'm only dealing damage with wild bolt. And you guys will see the record at the end. You guys will see what we ended off as, all the stats, how many max bolts we hit, and just some crazy overall matches. So I really hope you guys enjoy the video, and um, I'll see you guys at the end. All right, game one. Starting off, we got first turn. Gonna use a blade here just to get that early pressure in case I do, you know, somehow hit a max bolt. And now we start off with the bolting. First one of the series. Hopefully a max would be insane, but we started off with a mid bolt. So write that down. Followed up by not one, not even two, but three low ends in a row. Then we finally get some pressure by getting the max bolt, 1900 damage. There we go. There's the max, finally. I thought I was gonna die here to this uh, this judgment, but somehow I lived, even with the trap, was kinda crazy. Had two more chances to hit a max bolt to kill, and we hit 18 and 18 once again. He follows it up with a judgment, and I get destroyed, and I start off the 30 games 0 and 1. I mean, you know, it's gonna be, I'm gonna get lucky, and I'm gonna get unlucky on some, you know, that's just how it's gonna be. All right, game two, starting off with the first shield of what felt like a billion. Follow that up with a mid bolt there with another mid bolt. And then we hit a low end bolt through the shield for eight damage. Love to see that. Followed up next by a Catalan for literally all my health, though. It's okay because clearly we're going to hit max here, right? No, I'm just kidding. Ten damage. He shields again for like the billionth time. Follow that up through the shield for a, another mid bolt. But it's okay, guys, because we hit max here through the shield. There's a max, finally. Only to get Triton for 1,500 damage and starting off the 30 games 0-2, GG on to the next.
Oh, she's captain. All right. So game three started off pretty quick with a mid bolt right to the dome. Followed up, she stole my pip. Steal pip. Okay. So now we are forced to blade. Or I can shield. I hear I'll shield here. So we put the shield on, hoping to prevent any big damage since she does have seven pips. But, spoiler alert, all she's going to do is use a zero pip hit wand hit to take off my shield. Now giving her even more pips. And we hit another mid bolt. Awesome. Yay. And then it's pretty much just rinse and repeat from here on from the last match. Catalan for 1100. Don't get the max here, just another mid. And then she's going to put a triton here to finish me off. Another 1500 damage to put me down to 0 and 3 in the 30 games so far. Game 4 was a relatively quick one against a fire. Starts off with a steel pip, so I decided to blade just to maybe put some pressure on, but we ended up just hitting a mid bolt. Ah, damn, it would have done so much. And then he follows up with a single buffed elephant. This elephant does way too much damage. 1700, I'm pretty much just dead now. Two mid bolts in a row through the shield here on this one, and then he just sends the Krampus, and it's just going to be GG, and we're going to just forget about this game, good lord. Game 5 was actually a pretty interesting game. Had first turn, so I went with the blade. He does a blade of his own. We send the bolt, and it's just another mid. And we hit mid. Awesome. Great. We go for another one through the shield here. Wow, there's a max. Finally, about time that I hit another max. Go for another bolt here. We hit another mid. But then another shield pops up, and of course, once again, another max through the shield. We hit another! Of course it's through the shield. Never when it's... Never when it's un unshielded. And of course, obviously, he'll just use Helifant here to kill me. Uh, hello? What? Well, obviously, Hephaestus is weak as fuck, so this is not going to kill me. I don't know why he did this shit. But we have a bolt here, and it's low end. And finally, Max Bolt wins it here. That's just so... Oh, man, that's so tough, dude. That's I've used, like, I don't even know how many I use this match. And then he just sends the brim and another game, 0 oh and 5 to start off. We have finally had a game where I hit more than one max. And we are up to four maxes total. All right, moving into game six, playing a knight balance wizard is what it looks like. Going to send the bolt, turn one. And we hit max, turn one. That's what we like to see. And he comes out of that with a steel pip here. So we are forced to put the blade on. You know, can't do anything else with just one pip. So we put the blade on, and then he sends a Hydra out of left field, dumping all his pips, and, you know, not really doing too much damage either, so put me in good position for one more max bolt to win it, you know. Gonna send it, gonna send it quick. Here we go. And we hit the max! Finally! Let's go! Finally! It's about time! Only took five games. And this, in the sixth game, we finally get the first win. Two max bolts back to back. Let's go. Now, that's what I'm talking about, turning it around for once. Let's fucking go, dude. Holy shit. I know Zachary's pissed. I'm going to go ahead and leave this realm so he can't say anything. Game seven against an ice, starting off with a mid bolt here into a low end, into another low end, and then we have another mid bolt. Hey, here comes a max. There's one. There's one. But it doesn't matter because I'm dead. And we are now one and six. All right, game eight, starting off with a blade to try and build some pressure here. Because I could take her out with one bolt here. That is that is the beauty of, of blading. And she didn't shield, so we're going to go ahead and send the bolt with the blade. Give it to me, the one shot. Give me the one shot. We got the one shot. Let's go. That's so huge. That's awesome. Let's go. Oh, you love to see- that's crazy! <laughs> that's- Oh no! Oh my god, that's fine. We hit- we hit a max though, we hit a max. Game 9, we actually get into a little bit of a bolt battle here with another Storm. She's gonna start off by hitting a low end. I follow that up with a mid. She comes back at me with another low end bolt. Then we hit another mid, and then she actually is going to start playing like a competent Storm Wizard and depletes half my health of the Catalan. And all I can do is hit her with a low bolt and then hit her with another mid bolt. And then she's going to finish me off with a Stormzilla. GG's, on to the next game, get me out. Alright, game 10 against a Captain Myth, and I pretty much knew my fate after this mid bolt. And it's, it's just pretty much wraps now, it's pretty much wraps. And like I said, Ninja Pix just does way too much damage, absolutely destroyed. Hold on, now wait! Wait, there's a max. There's a chance. There's literally a chance. Just kidding. I lied. Uh, Athena right to the dome. 
And uh, yeah, I mean, I'm just not winning this one. Game 11 against the death, just you know, it was the same old, just a lot of low and mid bolts. And then she's going to use the freaking death oni on me, I guess, you know, do all my health here, and then follows it up with this, whatever this four pip spell is, and then we're just dead, so GG. Game 12 against the storm, I kind of got hit with a little bit of my own medicine here. And he hit Max! And I decided to just blade here for some reason, and that just makes him put on a set shield. And then we hit through the set shield, and it just hit a mid bolt. I mean, yeah, he can just shield, shield, and then just, yeah, just, uh, you know, GG's. So we hit through the shield here, we get a max, and then he's just gonna crack it, right? Uh, what is he doing? So you're saying there's a chance. There is a chance here. There is a chance. Dude, if it was a regular match, bro, I could, could just crack in or try and... I got you, fam! Gotta send it. We need a max. We hit it! We hit it! Let's go! Oh, back to back! Back to back matches. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's go! Oh, that's crazy. Alright, game 13 coming in. I'm um, doing the rest of these games on stream over on my Twitch channel. And just an FYI, the timer above is for the current subathon that we're doing over there on Twitch. It's actually almost over right now. Um, but anyway, you guys should really come check out my Twitch channel if you haven't already. It's going to be linked below in the description. We do all sorts of fun stuff on stream, including Wiz PvP, all that good stuff. Um, but yeah, you guys should really come check me out. I'd, I'd be greatly appreciated if y'all did. But anyway, we were able to hit one max bolt through a shield. Of course! And then I let him get a double buff samurai, um, and then he does another one as well. Pretty much kills us. Not all the way, though. Then he just sends the wand hit. Couldn't really get any other bolts going, and it's just GG, another loss on the tally. Game 14 started off like every other game with a bolt turn one. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Hold on, wait, wait. And after that, he pretty much just gave up. So we sent a couple more bolts, hit some mids and lows, and then finally we were able to get him with the max bolt to get a much-needed win go dude all right let's go we got the fourth dub i don't even want to talk about game 15 dude this game was so bad i got catalan twice for all my health and then i didn't hit a single max bolt no no momentum whatsoever he finished me off with a wand hit this game was just doomed from the start game 16 started off so good And then literally I didn't hit another max bolt the rest of the game. I ended up just losing to a wanted. I literally had so many chances to hit a max bolt. She kept shielding and it just never hit. It never hit after that first one. Game 17 was like the slowest and most boring game of all time. I mean, I literally hit a max bolt really early on on this turn right here. But it didn't even matter because he literally just healed and healed and healed and healed off all the damage. I couldn't keep up with my bolts because I didn't hit max either. And he just slowly and slowly and slowly wore me down and killed me. And it was just so painful to play and so painful to watch. I'm not going to bore you guys with all that. Game 18 was actually really, really crazy. We're playing against the death. And this got really intense. It was a pretty long match. As you can see, she starts off with a threefold here, which can only mean one thing. You're going to be seeing a lot of this spell right here. So, so, so annoying to play against. Puts on the two minus 60% weaknesses that are just so fun to deal with. And I was able to get a couple of cheeky max bolts through the weaknesses. You know, didn't do a ton of damage like this one right here. But still, a little bit of these will, will do some good work. I even had to reshuffle. We used so many bolts in this match. Still have a chance here at 322 health. And I'm going to send another bolt here through a double weakness. Double weakness and a shield here. And it was just crazy. I hit Max, dude, that's crazy. She sends the ghoul, doesn't quite kill me, leaves us with one more chance. Nothing else, gotta hit Max here. This is it. Ah, didn't quite get the Max bolt. She ends up finishing me off with a wand hit, but this game was, this game was super close and I was in it. That was such a cra that was a crazy game, dude. That was a crazy game. Game 19 and gets another life. Yay, we all know what happened last time we played a life, right? Let's hope this one can turn out a little bit better than that one. I feel like I'm bound to hit a max at some point there, right? There it is! <laughs> I just spoke into existence. Nice, 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 nice. Even with the max bolt, of course, you know, he's just gonna spam this spell. God, I hate this spell so, so, so much. 
But it's okay though, it's okay. He gets to a point, he sends a single bladed, I guess life Oni, whatever this spell is, doesn't kill me, and he's still in single bolt range, so there's still a chance for me. <gasps> oh my god! Let's go. Let's fucking go, baby. Yeah, game 20 did, definitely did not have the same fate. He sends the double buff emulate, which just does so much damage, and I didn't hit any bolts, nothing. He sends the apocalypse, and I'm just dead, so move on. I am indeed dead to that. Game 21 started off with an early bolt against this balance. Oh my god, we, oh my god, we hit it. Wait. Yo, chill. But she slowly kind of whittled me down and shielded in the process. And even though we hit this max right here, I hit max through the shield, of course. Of course. It ultimately let it come down to where we have to hit a bolt to win it. All right, got to hit max here. We got it, got to have it. It's a must. Oh, tough. That's tough. And of course, she has the wanted at the ready. Yeah, GG's. GG's, GG's. Chalk it up. Game 22, my opponent literally didn't even show up. Oh my god, we got a free win, guys! <laughs> Wait. Game 23 against the Storm, who decided to put on two different 35 blades. I'm just cooked. I gotta hit max like now. I gotta hit max like now. Oh my god, we hit it! Oh my god, wait. Even though we hit the max bolt there, he's just gonna use the double buffed catch of the day just to do an absurd amount of damage. Like seriously, 2k with one hit is crazy. Thought we were gonna have to hit a max to win here. <sighs> Damn it! Didn't get it, but he ended up putting on a minus 85 set shield. Wasn't sure if a bolt was gonna kill through, but we just had to send it anyway and find out. <gasps> oh my god, it did! <sighs> oh my god! Why ain't no way, boy? Game 24 against this myth, and I literally still can't even fathom what happened in this game. Like, this has got to be one of the worst players I've ever seen, like, in my life. Like, you guys don't even understand. I, I send the bolt here through the shield, and, you know, of course, like usual. Of course, I hit max through it. Of course. She keeps buffing up to get quad buffed. She has a quad buffed hit here. Instead of sending the pigs, you'll see what happens. I'm just going to let you guys watch this sequence of events. Why is she minotauring? Wait, she just used one of her buffs. That trap's not going to go for both. Wait, there's a chance. Wait. Oh, wait. They're, oh, my. Wait, we're so in this. Hello? Deck fail? I, she's had so many turns to pull. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, hell, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? What am I watching right now? What is going on? And then it literally got to the point where I could have just won the game with a mid or max bolt. Either one would have won. So I just send it and we just find out what happens. I hit max! <laughs> <laughs> what am I? What did I just witness? What did I just witness? <laughs> game 25 went like this. So I'll just let you watch. All right, let's hop back on the max bolt train. Let's go. Oh my God. What is happening? No, no, there's already no way. Yeah, no, Catalan was smart, Catalan was smart. The, the luck's been good, man. Oh my god! No, there's... I'm done. I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you guys watch this game. I honestly feel bad for this person. Like, this was ridiculous, bro. Easy max bolt. Off the bat. Let's go. No way, right? Dude, there is literally... Guys, guys, no, there's actually no way. Oh my god! Guys, no. Oh yeah, he's, he's dead to another one. If we hit three max bolts in a row here... <laughs> yeah, boy. Guys! No way! There's no way! No shot! 
I just hit three in a row. Getting into game 27 here, but first, can we just talk about the fact that I just won counting the game where my opponent didn't show up five in a row? Are you absolutely, are you kidding me? Like, I would have never thought. With only Wild Bolt winning five in a row just feels absolutely absurd. Even going back through the footage now, like watching back those games, like that is absolutely ridiculous. Like the Wild Bolt luck that we were getting was just just otherworldly I can't even I don't have any other words to describe it uh but this game we just got destroyed by this balance here so we're not going to talk about that well that's a bad number hello game 28 got destroyed by a death wizard this actually might do enough low key I think this might kill I think it did 11 unbuffed yeah it does kill tough that's tough game 29 had a mid-round distraction okay I gotta go get this chicken out I gotta get it like now. And I ran, I came back, and I barely, barely missed my turn. No, I didn't make it back in time for my turn. Fuck! <laughs> but it doesn't even matter because literally I just got hydrated uh, and I was dead. So GG on that one. Going into game 30, just now realizing this is gonna be my last game that I can just brainlessly spam Wild Bolt and, you know, and Grandmaster Storm PvP, man. You know, it was just, it was an interesting, it was an interesting thought process. You know, going in, Hoping we could win the game, you know, thinking back on all the matches we did, you know, had a good time. This series was was super fun to make. A lot of hard work on it, all the matches, all the editing, you know, that we're doing on this. But um, yeah, I just, you know, I really hope you guys have enjoyed so far. We're gonna we're gonna see what happens in this final match against a veteran storm here. Oh my god, we hit max. Wait. Wait, I if I can survive. If I can survive and hit a and hit another max. Wait, guys, hold on. Oh, it's gonna be so close. Well, I guess we'll never know. After failing to clutch the game with one final max bolt, we watched the Kraken that ultimately ended the series here just finish us off and give us our 20th loss. It's tough. tough. To, it has to end like that, but, you know, that's just, just how it is. All right, so after it's all said and done, after all the matches, we ended with a record of, I think it was... Ignore the 11 and 21. It was 10 and 20. I played a couple of extra like regular matches, but the end the end record was 10 and 20. That was what we finished with. Honestly, better than I expected, Loki. We definitely got really lucky on it was like what we won like four in a row. It was absolutely ridiculous. Um, but we we definitely got lucky on that um, and ended as a recruit with 15, 16 as our rank our rating. Now I know we did start at sergeant. That was just because going into this season from the last season I had been a little bit higher up already before so that's why we get a little bit of an extra boost so i don't know how real the rating would be if i did this challenge starting from just straight up 1500 but we did end a little bit over 1500 so you know there is that that positive the bolt stats i know you guys have been waiting to hear this so we have 46 low end bolts 85 mid bolts and then 36 max bolts so if you put those percentages out you have about 28 to 30 percent were low bolts uh about 50 to 51 percent were mid bolts and then really close to about 21 to 20 percent were max bolts so a little bit favored on the side of the low end is the distribution is as you can see of course the mid is the most common with about 50 51 percent um but the low end is a little bit more favored so it's a little bit more rare to hit that max bolt so next time you want to use wild bolt now you know that percentage of you getting that you know that max bolt for the win is about roughly 20 21 percent of the time so i thought that was pretty cool to find out and get that sort of you know percent oh slay you know whatever like you know everyone knows that already but you know hey listen it was fun i enjoyed doing the uh the challenge um and i hope you guys enjoyed all the matches man i mean it was a uh, it was some crazy intense moments there um you know i hope i didn't break you guys eardrums too much but yeah you know stay tuned for more uh, pvp matches up on the channel um and, you know, if you haven't already, make sure you click that sub button, drop a like. I put a lot of effort in on this video, so uh, it would mean a lot to me if you guys did. But anyways, that's all I have for you. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.